Hey guys, Veteran Trainer John here, and welcome back to another Wi-Fi battle. I know I'm stuck doing post comms for a little bit. Um, uh, I got busy and I didn't have the opportunity to record these live, so I decided to do a post. Today we're battling quite an Uber team. He had a few Ubers on there, you know, Tapu, and then uh, Necrozma. So, I mean, it was a pretty, uh, pretty interesting. So I'm like, okay, well, I lead uh, with my Murkrow, and he leads Sepakoko. Okay. Well, I'm not going to want to take anything this guy wants to do. Um, yeah, no no electric attacks for me. That's a bad day. So I decided to just swap right out into Garchomp. Or Gliscor, I'm sorry. I apologize. I don't have Garchomp in this battle. Shame on me. But, so my uh, Toxic Orb does get to activate. And I am carrying and fleeing. And I thought about, like, no, he's not going to swap, probably. He's just going to... I don't know what he's going to do. And he ends up nature madnessing me, which isn't too bad, but since uh, I'm EV'd right, and, uh, you know, it does less than half. And um, I'm going to be easily able to recover that with uh, Toxic Heal. Or Poison Heal, I'm sorry. <clears throat> so this is going pretty good for me, and he goes into the crows, and I'm like, okay. I can hit it with an Earthquake, Stone Edge, I can Protect... Or I could fling! So I fling my Toxic Orb, you know. This set probably worked better with Acrobatics. Um, but uh, since this is basically the team I used in the Draft League battle, I decided that it was, you know, just leave it as it is. And um, the Prismatic Laser takes me out. I was kind of thinking I'd live that barely. But no, I go down. I go down quickly too. Uh, so I go into Victini here, which isn't on my Draft team actually so I did change it up slightly and I'm like okay so I want to kind of gauge to see how much damage I would do um, and I don't know why I guess I wasn't sure at the time that this was a recharge move um, and so I just wanted to gauge to see if I could take it out with a blue bolt uh, blue flare and uh, I can't so I'm gonna have to go for V create because I was just, I'm trying to keep, the goal here was to not lose as many Pokemon as possible against this Ubers team, or team with some Ubers on it. And uh, he's going right out into Lanala, and this thing easily scares me out, since makes me go right back out into Murkrow. He's already down two Pokemon. So he's got this, Galio. I don't even remember the rest of his team. It was, it, weren't, it was a, you know, it wouldn't have done well in Ubers. And, you know, it didn't do well against my mixed tier team. So, um, that didn't do a whole lot to me. I mean, it did good damage. And I, Mean Look here, I forget that Ghost Pokemon are immune to Mean Look. Um, so that kind of sucks. And then this Hyper Beam does a crap ton to me. And I'm like, okay. Um, I do make some misplays here with the Murkrow. I should have just, like, done the, uh, the, uh, Pear Song. And then toxic tier, so that way he was going down. Because I don't think this player was very good. I mean, obviously he took down a few of my mons. So I mean, he's not like you know ass, complete ass. But he did bring an Uber's team, and he got he did lose. I'm gonna spoil it for you. He did not win this battle. And um, so right here, I'm just going to toxic in it. I decided I'm not, it's not worth keeping Murkrow alive because Hyper Beam just does way too much damage to me. And it's, I could stall out his Hyper Beams, but that's no fun. I got something that could handle this. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to win this battle this way. Um, so he's just going to Hyper Beam me again, I guess, in case I roost it or something. I think it's a little overkill, but. This guy has the best luck with Hyper Beams. I know I miss Hyper Beams all the time. I'm carrying these around. I have them in my hand because I was playing with it. But if you saw one of my recent opening videos, you know that these were quite almost useful. Almost. So I'm going to send out v uh, Victini here. I'm going to hit him with a blue flare while he's recharging just to kind of gauge to see how much damage it does. And with the Toxic, I won't even need to go for V-Create. I will be able to take it out with the uh, blue flare. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep my stats as high as possible for as long as possible and try to win this the good old fashioned way. Right. Um, he goes into Mimikyu. Okay. Mimikyu, very good Pokemon. 
very intimidating. Um, I'm kind of hoping that I get the burn here. I know Blue Flare has that chance to burn. And um, I don't get it. Uh, but I do break it sturdy. I'm like, okay. Or it's disguise. I'm sorry. And Shadow Claw does a crap ton to me. But he he does get the crit. So the crit didn't matter too much. It wasn't going to be enough to take me out. But V Create is going to be enough to one shot this guy. And that is a Mimikyu. And bye bye. Sad to see you go. But whatever. So that's Mimikyu down. And then he's going to send out this thing. So, okay, alright. I know this thing is going to go for Darkest Lariat. I mean, there's no way he's not going to go for Darkest Lariat. Um, I don't know. I don't know why he sent this thing in. I mean, I, it's one of his last two Pokemon. That's why he sent it in. I don't know why I said that. That was dumb of me to say. But, um, Darkest Lariat does decent damage to my uh, Garchomp, even though I have zero defense investment at all. And um, I'm just going to be able to Earthquake the last two Pokemon he has and win this battle. Now, I know this wasn't like a glorious battle or anything, but um, I am so busy that I kind of need to make the most out of the battles I do record, um, I do have. And um, so, and even though this one's not that great, I probably won't make this its own like thing. It'll probably be like one of my in-between days that I'll upload this because it's not like an amazing battle. But it is, it is a good battle, I guess, and it does show that just because you have some Ubers on your team, it doesn't mean you're going to win. So if you liked the video, drop a like down below. If you didn't like it, dislike it. Tell me why. Have a great day, guys. Subscribe if you're new. I love you. Bye-bye.